Hello, 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 my friends. How are we here in Melbourne? It is a beautiful, actually sort of warm for winter. It's a very warm day outside today. I have a card for you today using Jane's Doodles and a couple other bits and pieces. So we've drawn, we've used a stencil that has just lots, a few different shapes. It was about four, we saw it just before, but about four different sizes of circles. I've just traced that. I have erased some of my pencil mark, uh, but honestly, she don't matter. It don't matter whatsoever because you're not going to see it because underneath this very dark, warm gray, it's hidden, but I did remove it slightly because you know, once you put your Copic markers on it, she ain't moving at all. So we're going to use um, the range of W's. I did sort of think right there that I would use a, you do a highlight sort of thing, um, but clearly you're going to see very shortly, oh, I completely decided to change my mind yet again. I have W7, which the end is on there. I'm I have a W5, a W3 going down to a W1. The very, very center of this is going to be very, very white. I'm going to use a white as the O marker. It's not white, O, to leave like a white highlight right in the center of him. So we're going to fill in that. The images I'm using today, I have actually cut them out with my scanner card for, I think, the last card. So these are sort of the leftovers, so I'm going to use them. So we've got the V28, V25 going down to a V22. Now this color, these colors are going to repeat themselves in the, I think it's a mousse. We're just going to call it a mousse. I'm also going to use an, another blue green on the other little cute penguin. And that blue green is going to repeat into the mousse as well. Their little headphones are going to be white. So while I color those, last time I spoke to you, we had, well, last time I spoke to you about my holiday in America, we had gone up to Redding in California. There was a car show on um, so that was pretty cool for an Aussie person to check out their car show. They just had a bit of a parade um, of the old cars going up. So we had dinner there and we stayed there for the night. And then the next day we, I know we went to Turtle Bay Sanctuary and we went to another spot. Now, I can't remember with this, this is Turtle Bay and I haven't looked at my photos and everything else, but there is a sundial bridge. So we picked up a, well, we met a friend of my aunt's and both of these parks, we sort of had roam around and, and got to check out the animals, uh, saw some little cute woodpeckers. Oh my gosh. You know, there's, it's just, I actually saw all the holes in the trees first and I went, I know what that is. Well, I didn't really know, but I was pretty sure I knew what that was. And sure enough, and I did actually see a couple of woodpeckers and I did, did actually get some photos, but it wasn't terribly, you know, you're trying to get a very small little animal up a very big tree, you know. We'll come back to that. We're just using some C3, C5 and down to C1 for our earmuffs. We're going to go the darker end of the combination for his hooves and his nose. So we've got the 100, which you can't quite see, but we've got the 100, we've got C9, C7 down to a C5. I'm going to use the same colors on our penguins, just sort of so we, they have a little bit of highlight, a little bit of interest. So we went over this bridge. Um, we could see Mount Shasta up down the end with all of its snowy glory. And yeah, so lots of animals, saw some deer, saw some squirrels. 
Um, I just love squirrels. I don't know whether other people love squirrels that actually live in America, but I think they're pretty stinking cute. And their tails weren't quite what I expected. It's really like a like a feather, you know, like a very thin tail with lots of foof, you know, lots of foofy bits and pieces. Um, my little beaks are white R25, as you can see there. And I'm going to use the same combinations. Actually, I'm going to just use C3 and C1 for their white to just give a little bit of highlight to everything. Uh, so we had a, a nice little walk. It was quite warm. Um, the two mums, we've decided because I was talking, I was with my cousins. So um, they, we nicknamed them Mum 1 and Mum 2. Not really a nickname. But, you know, it was like, oh, your mum, my mum, your mum, my mum. So it's like mum one, mum two. My mum was the oldest, so she's mum one. I think pretty logical. So they hopped on a little golf buggy and went for a ride. And my cousins and the other lady, we went for a walk down over the bridge. And it's all like a... I wouldn't call it a glass bottom, but it's that crystal, that almost clear sort of brick. So that was really fun. That was really good. We also went up to Grandma Maxine's house. Now, I can't remember where where she lived, but it's sort of right near, um, relatively close to Mount Shasta. And... She has a, well, she's passed away. Um, I don't know when she passed away, but she passed away a little while ago. Get back to that. We've got E57, 55, 53, and down to 51 for our moose. I am going to use, oh, and 59. We're just going to go a little bit darker on his legs. I am going to use the lighter two colors you can see there for his antlers just to have a little bit of definition i yes yeah, so we slept there grandma maxine has lots of little lovely bits and pieces um that we're slowly going through well not me my cousin and family are slowly going through beautiful old old things that we just don't or don't see in Australia, you know, like an icebox, um, snow horse shoes, um, cool, cool things like that. So it was a lot of fun. I've trimmed down my card front to be 9.7 by 14.1. And I'm just trying to figure out where I'm going to place everything. Now, what I've done here, because they're digital images, so I've printed out a lot of the sentiments that I had. Now, there's there's all sorts of different sentiments in that um, out of different um, collections and all sorts of things. And I've printed out one sheet so I can just go through and pick out whatever I want. And some of them are doubled, which is all good. So I've got this good luck. We've got this paper that's just out of a photo play. Uh, Brights, I think it was. Stamp uh, collection. And we've just cut a little strip. So we've got this tealy sort of colour. That sort of, it's a little bit brighter than our mousse, our scarves. But it sort of goes along the line. So it works. So I'm going to foam mount him all up. So, yeah, so we stayed there overnight. Um, it was very, very cool to see big mounds of snow. We went to the family ranch, which is where my cousin got married. Uh, fully, full, well, not fully, but quite a lot of snow still there. And I think this was about two or three weeks before Memorial Day I think it was two weeks before Memorial Day 
So we had to check it out to see whether she was going to be able to camp there for the next week, uh, the next couple of weeks. And so we stayed there. We went around. Uh, the next day, we I drove. <laughs> I drove. I did not want to drive in traffic for the first time, but I drove. So we'll catch up on that later. That's it. Take care. Bye-bye.